Yeah. It's a short O. How's a short O sound? Ah. Ah. This Break the Mold winner is not your typical teacher. Debbie Zagara didn't start out in education. Becoming a teacher wasn't even on her radar until she had her own children with special needs. Her experiences with learning how to help her children inspired her to make a career change. She cares deeply. Obviously, she was doing something, she's, she has an architectural degree. So when, you know, she went through the process of having her kids in uh, special education in Boone County, she learned a lot, but she wanted to dig deeper and she wanted to learn more. And so she went back to school, got her degree, uh, did her student teaching, did her practicum here, and was connected to North Point in a way that's very special. I've been blessed that the teachers, our kids all went through North Point. So the teachers that they've had taught me how to help them. And then being in grad school and doing my um, study here, I've learned from every teacher in this building. So I feel like it's a collaborative effort. Um, this, this award is a team effort because I've learned from everybody. What makes this award so special for Mrs. Zagara is that she was nominated by a professional peer, a parent, who is also a teacher. Karen Morelli's son was Mrs. Zagara's student. She is exceptional. She is exceptional. She is talented in what she does. Mrs. Zagara teaches self-worth. I mean something, Mrs. Zagara. She also teaches self-confidence. Well, you know what? Mrs. Zagara, she believes in me. Well, she believes in me, then I can do it. Debbie Zagara has been teaching fourth and fifth grade special education at North Point Elementary School for only three years. But in that short time, she has had an effect on so many of her students and peers. On this day, she was working in Abby Kuhn's fifth grade class. The other day, one of the things that she said to me was that she um, just wanted kids to feel special. If they're, um, it was one of the first few days of school, and she was trying to set the tone for um, what she does in her room and, and why she's here and that she loves these kids. And one of the things she, that really just um, drove home for me, like that first day, was um, I just if they took nothing away today, I just want them to know that they're special. Everybody needs to feel special, and, and I try and do this with my own children at home, you know. Go out of your way to say hi. Go out of your way to compliment somebody because that might be the only person that tells them something nice that day. And I think that North Point does a really good job of integrating our special needs um, students into the general classroom. And what we see is not only our special education students growing, but we see the general population growing, learning how to help them and becoming compassionate and understanding and patient with them. So Debbie, congratulations. You've made a huge difference for all of our students here, uh, for all of our parents that you've been working with, but I want to tell you that you've made a big difference here at our school with the culture of the building. Uh, she is orange. She understands the, the power of positivity and looking at the, the uh, upside of things, and she sees the potential in all of her students. So congratulations on becoming the Break the Mold Award winner. We are so proud of you and so happy that you're here as part of our team officially at North Point Elementary School.